I remember years ago, Matt, telling me when he was a kid, he grew up in Connecticut. He went to Yankee Stadium, was a Yankees fan, and Roger Clemens was his guy. And he'd wait after the game, players' parking lot, and see Roger come out just to see him. And there was a little bit of Roger in his game, Matt Harvey I'm talking about, early in his career, the way he'd go after people. Very different pitcher now. Here's Matt Harvey's first pitches of his first three, uh, five or six starts here, right? This is what I'm looking at. My, Matt Harvey, you see the delivery, hands at the belt, then he rocks him up a little bit. What I'm noticing here, that pitch right there, that was a sinker. Yeah, 95. There's another one at mm -hmm. 92. You know, we got used to for years Matt throwing 97 to 99, top of the zone with the four seam fastball. When I saw his last start, he changed. He got the hands up in front of the chest the way that Roger did. No more of that hands at the belt thing. It's worked for him. So here's the sinker I'm talking about. And this is the first, again, three starts here, first pitch of the game, sinker. He actually did that today, too. First pitch was a sinker. Sinker has become a really good pitch for him because it gets him quicker outs. He doesn't have the velocity to blow people away. He doesn't want to get into deep, long counts. Doesn't have that really wipe out pitch that he had back in the day. So if he can get two outs quickly on a ground ball, he'll get it. And that's what the sinker has been doing for him. I give him credit because that's not an easy transition to make. You lose velocity. You have to find another way. He's done that with a sinker, a, real, a pitch he really had not thrown before in his career, and it's become very good for him. No home runs allowed on that sinker. He's thrown about a, 180 sinkers this year, no home runs. That tells you he's locating well. Let's go back to 15 again. Here's Matt really at his best with that good four-seam fastball. Compare that to the delivery now. You see a little bit of the Clemens with the hands up in front of the chest delivery, but now you're seeing sinkers, not four-seamers. Here's the other thing I want to point out. Remember, he got hurt back then. He's moved on the rubber a little bit, but he had some mechanics that made him vulnerable to injuries. I'll point them out right here. When he gets to this position, see how his elbows get higher than his shoulder? Watch it now. Now he's got a straight line there. And now who does that remind you of? Roger Clemens. Wow. His mechanics were picture perfect. So Matt not only added a different pitch in terms of going to sinker rather than four seamers, he's cleaned up his mechanics, and I think this will help him stay healthier. See here the decline in that four seam velocity. You know, this is what happens as you age. You know, velocity is a gift that doesn't last your entire career. Most guys have to make this transition. Uh, some guys fight it, and I give Matt Harvey credit for not fighting it. Today, he threw, by my count, he, 78 pitches today. He threw a career high, 50 sinkers in the game uh, today. Uh, wow. He was 32. His last start was as high. He went to 50 sinkers today. That's a lot. 67% sinkers today. Shows you he's very comfortable now making this transition. So even within this season, Adnan, he's changed a little bit of his delivery. He's straightened out his mechanics. I'm sure he's done that in the past the last couple of years. And he's gotten to more and more sinkers, which tells me he's good where he's at. Results today, not what he wanted. Mm. But you got to say that he found something that works for him now.